Hi, and welcome to Benzinga TV. I'm Spencer White with the Benzinga News Desk. I'm here with Benzinga Editor Jason Chabnell. It's tax day. Millions of Americans are going to be looking forward to getting their returns in the next few weeks, but there's one set of returns that they aren't likely to see, President Donald Trump's. That's right. It's been a source of contention ever since Donald Trump announced that he was going to run for President of the United States. Um, you know, it's something that you know, people like to see a little more transparency from their, their government, especially, you know, the highest, uh, the highest level office in the country. And so, uh, you know, it's something that he is constantly tweeting about. And, you know, in his first press conference as president back in January, he said, you know, the only people that care about seeing these returns are, you know, a group of reporters out there. You know, he constantly talks about the fake media. Uh, however, you know, since that time and even even this past weekend, there have been several protests and, you know, other other events going on in terms of trying to bring his tax returns to light, Spencer. you want to go into that a little bit more? Yeah, it, I think it's a little inaccurate for President Trump to say that only reporters care about uh, his tax returns. Over 400,000 people have signed a change.org petition calling for the release of his returns. Mm -hmm. And in Washington, D.C. alone this week, 25,000 people demonstrated wow. to call for Donald Trump's tax returns and to agitate for progressive tax reform. You know, Jason, I sort of wonder whether it will do anything at all releasing his tax returns. You know, Bill Clinton released his tax returns before he became president in the 90s, and his White House was mm -hmm. constantly embroiled in scandals such as the Whitewater real estate deal. And also, it's fa fairly clear that from Trump's stated agenda that his tax reform will favor wealthy and in, uh, in large corporations. That's right. And, you know, speaking of controversy, this all started back when President Richard Nixon um, had his whole Watergate fiasco. That's when the first president uh, ever released his tax returns for the public eye to see. And ever since then, um, you know, every sitting president has released their reforms. Uh, you know, Gerald Ford actually didn't release his, his tax returns themselves, but he did release about 10 years worth of tax information um, in his life. And so he at least tried to be as transparent as he could with, uh, with his re returns. And so... It'll be interesting to see how this all rolls out in the next few days, especially as this tax, tax season is around us and it's still a hot topic issue, but it'll be interesting to see in the next three or four years even with Donald Trump and Vice President Mike Pence to see if, if they'll ever be as transparent as our, our previous uh, presidents have been. Certainly. If you like this video, feel free to subscribe to Benzinga TV. If you think Donald Trump should release his tax returns, comment below.